Coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division encounter. So here we go with round one, and when you are facing a submission specialist like this as a striker, you have got to avoid the canvas, I would think, at all. Yes, you have to. And if the striker gets taken down, he needs to make sure his only thought is to get back to his feet. Whether the submissionist goes to his back or is on top, you've got to make plan number one, getting back standing and getting back to your space. If not, you're going to find yourself tapping and really wondering why. Why did I not engage him in this game? Look at you dropping a submission. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. We're just missing. Oh! He's getting lit up. Ah, hey. oh, that jab hurt him. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Nice body kick right up the elbow. Leg kick thrown. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serves him up. Go get him. Really good body kick. there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Big powerful punch land. Now we get back to range. Just misses there with the left. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. If you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Oh! Goes down again! Round two coming up next! All right, let's check out some of the action, DC, and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. All right, let's get to round two. Nice leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes, goes into the round. Oh, and there it is, maybe the seminal blow. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He lands a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Oh, nice, nice right hand. Nice. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Just missed with the left there. Nice head kick. 
Blitz the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Liver kick. Head kick partially blocked. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Coming up next, it's a UFC light -like heavyweight division collision. Seems to be a throwback type of matchup here. The classically trained striker taking on the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black belt. But BJJ black belt with this guy doesn't even begin to describe his credentials. It does not describe how good he is. His vast knowledge of all the Jiu Jitsu positions. This guy, once you're on the ground, there is no place where you are safe. You are constantly getting attacked. He's always throwing up submissions, he's always attacking arms, he's always attacking your neck doing everything to try and make you think submission's coming, even if it's just to change positions to secure top. Right hand punch the clinch. Out of range with that. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. They're certainly getting after it early. Oh, huge head kick. He went high on that one. Nice hook lands. Oh! Oh, he's got him right here. Back to the feet. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. Oh, he got him. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. 
Look at him drive his shield into his opponent's body with that body kick. For certain, the finish could come at any time. And up with that finish. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Ooh, blocks the shot. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, and he caught the kick. So there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. All right, let's get to round two. Good stick. Very tricky when he throws that body stick. Connection right there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Some nice back and forth action here. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight.